Just heard from the Dallas Cowboys franchise quarterback. Now we've got the head coach, Mike McCarthy, and the play caller. Mike McCarthy, it's good to see you. It's good to be here with so, you guys. Uh, first, first time you're calling play since 2018. Did you practice by, you know, playing Madden in the offseason? Get that thing going? So you're like, okay, I'm in. No, I just uh, had to just go back and get back into the routine. But, yeah, I'm, I can't play Madden. I tried years ago, and I, I made the mistake of <laughs> not learning Madden in the early days. So, no, but it, it's great to get back into it. I'm really enjoying it. The offense, Mike, is it going to look different? Does it feel different to you? I know you came out right away and said emphasis on running the ball, uh, maybe a more of an emphasis. What is going to look different, if anything? Well, I'll say this. I think the, the, the quote was was more towards, you know, the change from 2020 to 2021. So, But I, I think if you look at run attempts, I think we'll be similar to between 21 and 20, or, okay. you know, 21 and 22. So, uh, I, you know, at the end of the day, it's about getting the ball distributed to your perimeter players. You know, obviously a big part of our offense the last two years primarily with Zeke and Tony. So that part of it is going to be different. Um, but, you know, we, we really – one to build off of what we established. I liked our run game, particularly mm -hmm. last year, the last two years. Yep. So we thought we just need to prove some things. I think the biggest difference for us will be more protection in, in the pass game. Is there a competition factor just for you personally? I mean, I know your goal is to have the best record in the NFL to go win the Super Bowl. But for you personally, I imagine this is something that you missed. Oh, absolutely. I mean, you're competing every day, and there's nothing better than competing against a defensive play caller on game day. Yeah, that, I mean, that's that's what I miss most about coming back after the year off. So, I mean, that, that, that part, uh, everybody wants to call plays, you know, until, until – you guys critique us. <laughs> Monday morning. When it works, yeah. Mike, you know, yeah, we yeah, love it. Yeah, you know? yeah, no doubt, no but, doubt. But, no, absolutely. I'm, I'm, I'm thrilled to be back into the competition of it. And so just Dak and you working together. I mean, I know you went back and looked at interceptions last year. You know, was there a common thread there? Or is there anything you can see in his game that – really had never shown up before. We haven't seen that from him before. Yeah, really, the, the process of the interception breakdown is more about decisions versus, you know, the other the other variables in the ball. I mean, you can really draw a line between them. So, you know, when you get concerned when there's a bunch of decision, decision interceptions, uh, you know, and the other ones, are it's just really football. And, you know, hey, you know, the best, best part of our training is we get to we get to work against the best in the league, you know, our defense as far as taking the ball away. So, uh, you know, I have great confidence in him and great confidence in our process. Individually, defensively, the guy standing behind you, Micah Parsons, there are a few better than him in this sport. What is the challenge as an offensive play caller? I don't want you to give away all these secrets, but when a guy like that is on the field, how difficult does it make it for the other side? Well, I mean, number one, you got to know where he is. I mean, every declaration in the run game and in and, and, and the pass uh, pass protection starts with him. And I think, you know, when it's just in the pass protection, that's one thing. But you have to be aware of him in the run game, too, because of his ability, you know, to play in the A and B gaps, you know. And that's why, obviously, we keep moving around and create targeting problems for the, for the opposing offense. Mike, talk about the addition of Brandon Cooks. Yep. Because he's always been a speed guy, yep. but he, he's been a very intelligent player. Yeah. He's played in a lot of different systems, and he's been productive. What have you seen so far that he can really add to this offense? Well, just to spring off of what you've already stated, I mean, he, he, he this guy's an outstanding route runner, but what he brings to the table in leadership is, you know, you just never know until you really get in the room, uh, particularly in veteran, you know, veteran free agency, and he has been a tremendous asset for us. He's great with our young players, the connection he already has with C.D. Lamb, uh, you know, the connection he has with the quarterback. So I've been extremely impressed with him, but he's an excellent, excellent route runner, and I think the benefit of playing in a number of different yep. systems has been awesome. How much do you love the pressure of coaching the Dallas Cowboys and knowing that if you don't win it, uh, that, hey, that's okay. Some places, maybe that's not the deal. Yeah. Here it is. Well, I mean, I've done this long enough that it's all about winning it. I mean, there's, I mean, there's nothing else that, that, you, that, you, you know, that you play for and you work for. And, what? Um, no, I, I love it. What are you doing? What are you doing? I was, what was that? Wait, I, I, don't, I, just, <laughs> I was getting, I was getting oh. Mike right in here. Oh. Like, just a, okay. like he says he wants to play offense. Yeah, that's what I hear. I don't know. Yeah. The, MVP I, I'm good. <laughs> the MPP. Hey, the Michael Parsons problem. Mike, we know that you're a busy man. Thanks for stopping by here on Back Together Weekend, presented to you by YouTube. We really appreciate it. You bet. All the best, gentlemen. You got it. Take care. Mike McCarthy, the head coach and play caller of your Dallas Cowboys. Micah, what's up, man? It'll, it'll probably be yes. I just wanted to be mine. Oh. All right. No, that's your idea always.